Good morning. Good morning. God bless you. It is Tuesday morning. We thank God for another beautiful day. Hallelujah. Let's turn our Bibles to Psalm 18, verse 1 to 6. Hallelujah. The Lord, our fighter. The Lord, our deliverer. The Lord, our strength. The psalmist says, I love you, Lord, my strength. The Lord is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer. My God is my rock in whom I take refuge, my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. I call to the Lord who is worthy to be praised and have been saved from my enemies. Voice 4. The cord of death in time come in. The torrents of destruction overwhelm me. The cause of the grace called around me, the snares of death confronted me. In my distress, I call to the Lord, I cry out to my God for help. From his temple he heard my voice, my cry came before him into his ears. Hallelujah. Since of the most high God, children of God who has given their life to Jesus Christ, I want to encourage you this morning. That you have a deliverer. You don't have to fight life battle by it by yourself. God is willing to help you. He is your helper. He is your deliverer. You don't have to be afraid of the things that come against you. No matter how the enemy fight, call on God. As we reread this scripture this morning. It's about King David when he was hiding from King Saul during all those years of battle. He said it was God who would deliver him. We all know the story of Saul. He was a powerful fighter, a powerful warrior. But you see, it doesn't matter how strong a person is or how powerful they are or how much influence they have. If you have God on your side and your hands are clean, your heart is pure, your ways are pleasing to the Lord. When the enemy comes from whatever, God will stand up for you. God will fight for you. God will deliver you from the snails of the enemy. He will fight on your behalf. I don't know what you are going through this morning. I don't know who is on your case, which devil, which demon is fighting your destiny, fighting your marriage, fighting your children, fighting your job. I want you to call on your deliverer this morning. Call on God to come to your refuge. He will intervene for you. He will destroy the works of the enemy. David said, I call. He said, even death. He said, death entangled me. He said, death was for death was wrapped up around me. In my disgrace, I called on the Lord. And he heard me for his holy hell. Call on God this morning. Don't fight alone. The host of heaven will fight alongside with you. I pray this morning for grace and strength. As you go through this life, you will know you have a deliverer. You will not depend on the arm of flesh. You will not depend on your own connection. You will not depend on money. You will not depend on anybody. You will depend on the living God. Receive that grace this morning in the mighty name of Jesus. Those of you who are listening this morning and are not saved, you can also enter in this morning. Uh, God too can fight for you. He loves you. He has a plan for your life. But you have to leave the camp of the enemy. You have to come to the kingdom of God so you too can enjoy the blessings of being a child of God. The issue of salvation is very serious. It's life's most important decision. Those who gave their life to Jesus serve and do his will. When they die, they go to heaven. Heaven is a beautiful place that God had destined for his children. Hell is a bad place. God does not want you to go to hell. Those who reject Jesus, those who live in continual sin, when they die, they go to hell. 
But this morning, I present heaven to you. I want you to invite Jesus in your life this morning. Just say, Lord, I'm sorry for all my sins. Come in my life and be my savior. I'm telling you, your life will never be the same. And God too will fight for you. The Lord bless you as you made that decision this morning. Lord, now I take charge of the atmosphere this morning. I bring an end tonight to wickedness. I cover our lives, the lives of our children, our husbands and wives in the blood of Jesus. I pray today, whatever we do, we will call on God. He is our strength. He is our deliverer. In the mighty name of Jesus, the Lord bless you. The Lord keep you. The Lord cause his face to shine upon you. The Lord be gracious unto you. And I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Bye-bye.